The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild is one of the most incredible games of all time. But does your father love you? Mine sure doesn't. And in this video, we'll see if I can beat Breath of the Wild while knowing my father will never look me in the eye and feel anything but disappointment and shame. But before we begin, according to YouTube statistics, only 90% of you are a good judge of character. Do better. With all that said, it's time to tackle my biggest challenge yet. Can you beat Breath of the Wild without your father's love? Let's get to it. I've barely put on pants and we're already faced with an insurmountable task. My dad never taught me how to swim. Try as I might, there's just no way I'm gonna get across this body of water. My shoes might get wet. No, I need to figure something else out. Maybe if I push some crates over, I could make a bridge? It's hard work, but despite what my dad thinks, I'm not opposed to hard work. I just have to be passionate about it. Hmm. It seems like this box doesn't want to go up the stairs. Maybe a second box will fix. Second box did not fix, and my ankles hurt too much to do this a third time. Hold on, I've got an idea. I'm gonna make a bridge with these little barrels because my weak arms can actually carry these up the stairs. Yeah, this'll probably work. Just gotta jump and... I knew it. If I touch that, I'm dead. Maybe I can... Or, or maybe I... No, no, no. I'm only at the first roadblock and things are already looking impossible. How is anybody supposed to beat this game? With no other options left, I decided to do the unthinkable. I clipped out of bounds, leaving the Shrine of Resurrection. We're in dangerous territory now, but this is how life goes without a father figure. All right, let me just walk around this right here and make my way up. Would you look at that? The open air! I've got the whole world to explore! Everything the sun touches is my co- oh, oh, oh. oh no. I appear to be stuck in the mountain. No worries, let me just- ah. Uh, uh. This is a metaphor for being trapped in my dad's perception of the person I should be. I just know it. <laughs> <laughs> kind of looks like I'm climbing this tree. Look at me. Ah! Huh. I seem to have broken free from the metaphor. <laughs> Screw you, dad. You think I could just... That moment's passed. Bug, 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 bug. The ladies love when I eat a bug. But my dad thinks it's gross and that I'm gross. And oh, oh God, I'm, I'm so gr gross and disgusting. Apples! An axe. My father wielded an axe to fend off the hordes. Never taught me though. Guess I'll just have to teach myself. How hard could it be? Hooah! Ah, 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 Just as I planned. I got the log, and I'm down here now. Another job well done. My dad used to compare me to a bundle of wood. Well, that's not the word he'd use. He'd call me a forget about that. We're on a hike, it's nature. Take a breath of that wild. Man, the render distance in this game is terrible. You can't even see the sky islands. Guess I should try doing something outdoorsy while I'm out here, like surfing. Look, Dad! I'm doing it! I'm doing- Ah! 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 Dad! Don't look! Maybe I should try sky surfing instead. I'm way more comfortable in the sky. Wahoo! <laughs> I'm doing it! I'm really doing it, Dad! What about the ground? What about it? Yeah, this game has fall damage canceling. Oh, you want to know how it works? Well, too bad. My dad didn't explain it to me. Figure it out. Shut up. <laughs> All right, here we are. First shrine time. Let's get that bomb rune. All right, we got bombs. Here we go. <laughs> We can 
try that again. Here we go! Ah! 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 <laughs> a few broken bones later and we finish the first shrine. My dad wore a hat just like that on harvesting day. Oh no, that's just two on the nose. A Nintendo Switch shirt? For real? No fooling? I was a little cold on my way to the stasis shrine, but that's no problem. Time to fall back and use the Simply Snap special. Save and bleh. Do you think I can maybe... <laughs> Let's go! That's shrine number two. Going up, call it. I'm gonna land on that Bacoblin, bank shot off the mountain, and land right beside that chest. Man, I'm good at sports. I don't WANNA GO TO SUMMER CAMP, YOU OLD BASTARD! Uh, oh. I was working through something there. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, I didn't have anything to say about this one. Oh, man! The Magnesis Shrine is all the way over there! Guess I gotta... Made it. Okay, that's number four. My dad used to dress like that before he personally regraded my math homework to see what my teacher missed. Didn't see that content warning on the box. Why does every man over 50 disappear? <laughs> okay, guys, it's time to make our way to Hyrule Castle. The road is long, and the challenges will be even more treacherous than before. It could take days. Weeks even, but I know we'll get there if we just buckle down and- This video was brought to you by Paid Me VPN. Do you want to use public Wi-Fi without dangerous hackers and spies intercepting your data? Would you like to browse the web secure in the knowledge that your data is protected by military-grade encryption? Well, good. That's already true. VPNs don't do that. Paid Me VPN is the only honest VPN in the market. They let me say what VPNs are actually good for. Piracy and pornography. Do you live in a state that's banning certain websites? Are you a fan of playing Nintendo games, but not a fan of buying them? Then visit paidmevpn.com slash simplysnaps for a frankly concerning percentage off your first order. Like, seriously, 83%? If a company always gives 83% off of their subscription price, it means they never plan on charging anybody that full price anyway, so it's not actually a discount. But I don't get paid to say stuff like that. I get paid to tell you about how good and important VPNs are, which they sure are. Paid Me VPN, the only VPN that paid me. Okay, here we are at Hyrule Castle. Before I head to the big guy himself, I'm gonna grab some supplies. Aha, uh -huh, yeah, floor bananas! Yeah, that's right. Play with your ball in the corner while I finish my important work. Learn that trick from my dad. I think I'd be a great mom. It's nap time! Oof. You see, you felt sympathy for the moblins just then because I personified them as my babies. I just want you to know they are not real and don't feel betrayal, unlike me who suffers many betrayals every day. Why don't you love me? All right, here we are, the top of Hyrule Castle. Tensions rising, we're nearing the climax. This would be the worst possible time to break the pace with some dumb scam. This video was actually brought to you by Paid Me More VPN. After several contract negotiations, I have permanently cut ties with Paid Me VPN and fully endorsed Paid Me More VPN. How much more secure is Paid Me More VPN? Uh, uh, double. D -d Twice as much secure. And what about their encryption? They added two zeros to my paycheck. I'll say whatever they want about their damn encryption. Go to PaidMeMoreVPN.com slash SimplySnaps for just 
way too much off your first purchase. Seriously, why does nobody question how large these discounts are? They're even throwing in three months for free? That's not how companies work. What are you, five? Companies don't give three months away for free unless they're still making a profit off of you. This shit is worth like three bucks a month and they're clowning you all into paying 10 times that because apparently it's discounted. Don't buy a VPN. You don't need one. Please, don't buy a VPN. And if you do, just get a cheap one like it. Hey, 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 what are you doing in my house? Hey! <coughs> Sorry about that. You know how hormones are. I'm better now. Better and pure. This video was brought to you by Paid Me More VPN. They paid me more to say this, so I'm telling you to support them instead of someone else. Now, back to the climax of this challenge. Whew! Getting up here sure was action-packed. I'm glad the pacing of this video wasn't ruined in any way. Ganon and Zelda are flailing around in that weird sack, so we gotta smack the shit out of his goons first. First up is Windblight Ganon, who's a total pushover. He's got a gun! Okay, it turns out pushovers can still push you over. I should make a word for that. It's okay, I've still got some health left. Ah, okay, what? Was that fair? I mean, I got him next time, but damn. Water Blight has a big spear, but not much water unless you fight it in the Divine Beast. In fact, all of these bosses kind of suck when removed from their intended arenas. Fire Blight isn't even a boss. I think she just lives here. Thunder Blight Ganon sucks. Look at this. I knocked it upstairs and it's nowhere near me. I must be safe, right? Nope. In a matter of frames, it goes from being stunned on the other end of the arena to on top of me with a lethal hitbox. Make it make sense. That's faster than my dad rushes over when I <laughs> change the thermostat. I don't know. I think this challenge has shown me something that I knew in my heart, but never really accepted. Breath of the Wild has horrible bosses. They've each got one or two attacks, all of their themes are the same, and they don't look distinct at all. If I blur the name, could you tell me which element this is? Do you actually feel confident about that? Well, la di da I still don't care. I beat Thunderblight on my next try because he didn't teleport around like a Dragon Ball character. The Calamity Ganon cutscene is super cinematic, but good lord, someone got hit by the fugly stick. I know this game was targeting a Wii U for performance, but Jesus, I do not remember him looking that low res. The goop has not held up. Oh my god, I'm sorry, I'm sorry! How do you like a face full of arrows? Ha! ha what the? Oh, it's over. This can't be. Everything I've worked for, everything I've learned, the hours I put into this challenge, and for what? Just to fail at the finish line? Victory is within my grasp, but it's as if my arms are bound behind my back. All I can do is scream into the abyss, scream for mercy, but the abyss doesn't scream back. It eats my sorrow and purrs. I'm finished, cooked, washed up. I can't beat Breath of the Wild without my father's love. I'm just not strong enough. What? Hello? Hello, Snappy. It's Papa. I... I miss you. Could we have a chat? Maybe catch up? Dad? I did it! I beat the game! All it took was my father's love and approval! I guess that answers the question of can you beat Breath of the Wild without your father's love? It turns out you c Wait, I beat it with his love. I failed the challenge. Ah, damn it, Dad! You ruined everything! I hate you! This is why I never call anymore! You're the worst dad ever!